It is now widely known the modern Russian descent not only from Slavic tribes, Vyatichi, Krivichi, Slovenia, Severiani, Dregovichi, but also from Uralic tribes, such as Meria, Mishra, and Murama. These are the tribes that have contributed and entirely dissolved in the ethnogenesis of Russian people. The problem arises when we try to estimate the amount of actual early Uralic, that is, same Oturbina culture input, that these Uralic tribes of Russia had. The land of Central Russia has since the Copper Age been Indo-European speaking, with huge genetical inputs from corded ware culture from Central Europe. Nganasan, like ancestry of the Miya culture, starts to arrive in the far north of Russia only in the Bronze Age. But does it make a genetic impact on Central Russia? We don't have sufficient evidence to determine that. As in, we don't have the sufficient evidence to determine that in the early ages it made an uh, impact on Central Russia. Modern Central Russians, we can analyze. And I will do so in la later in the video. In the late Bronze Age, Anandina culture starts to spread over Central Russia, bringing with it Uralic language and genes. The Anandina culture, however, was not replacing the indigenous Indo-European cultures of Russia, rather it was mixing with them. So the Mishra, Murama, Meria tribes had already an Indo-European and a Paleo-European substrate before being Uralicized. Looking at the DNA of modern Russians from Belgorod, Kostroma and Kaluga, we can model them as a mixture of Ukrainians, proxy for original uh, Slavic tribes, Hans, proxy for original Uralic speakers, Selkups, proxy for Yemiachtach culture, and Iron Age Ingrians, proxy for Paleo-European substrate. It seems that as we go north from Belgorod, the Paleo-European substrate increases. However, the Uralic substrate is present as we go east to Kostroma. The Miyahtach substrate isn't found anywhere. Based on the culture and genetics of Mishra and Murama, we can infer that they were identical to the Erza genetically as well. They both resent from medieval Rezan culture. Miria most likely occupied an intermediate point between Erza and Vepsians. I used the Dodecat K12b vectors in Octave to model the K12 coordinates of what Meria likely would have been like genetically. Now we can model Russians as a mixture of Ukrainians, Meria, Mishra Murama, and a proxy for, the, for Turkic people I chose Kazan Tatars. Since Kazan Tatars do not show up on the model despite being included in the source, we can infer that Russians do not have a Turkic substrate, at least not an additional Turkic substrate that the Ukrainians would lack.